Hey there, my name is Jason. I'm a registered polysomnographic technologist or registered sleep tech, and I want to do a quick mass fitting review overview of the uh, RestMed N10. So this is their newest uh, line of the AirFit. They have the P10, the N10, and the F10. This is the N10, the N being for nasal, like the nasal mask. Um, let me so let me show you some of the features on it, and then we'll kind of get started as far as fitting and stuff. It actually has some features, so. Bear with me. All right, so here is the N10. Um, one of the things is it has the, this is it out of the box. So it has this piece of plastic that's, you know, holds the frame, it holds the headgear. Um, it comes with these little um, cheek pads and I would like 100% highly recommend putting the cheek pad on. It can be a little bit of a pain, but just do it up front and, uh, and you'll be happy. So to do that, you have to undo one of the straps um, then you want to slide the cheek cushion over it and pull it down. Yay! Now you're not going to have those thick mask lines. My dad always has those, these big thick mask lines all the time. I'm like, why don't you wear some like these liners I got you? Oh, I always forget. Anyway, there's those. So, um, okay, so this thing has a diffuser. It's actually kind of loud, I found. Um, some of their other masks are much more quiet. Actually, a lot of other masks from other companies are a lot quieter. Um, one of the things I really cannot stand about this is it has no swivel right here. It's just actually, it's part of the frame. So if we unhook, and I'll show you this, you wanna find the tab on the top, tab on the bottom to get the cushion out and you pinch and this comes out, you can put a different size on or wash it, do whatever you want. Anyway, once you have just the frame here, you see that it's attached into it and there's no way to get it off. So if you have a, like a frisky cat or something or you just, I don't know, like to fight with your hose at night, um, if you damage this thing, your whole frame is gone and uh, you're kinda, I don't know, you have to get a whole new frame which is probably gonna be like buying a whole new mask. I can't imagine that being good. Anyway, when you put this back on, you'll see that there on the bottom is a narrow tab, and then on the top is a much wider tab. And so those correspond with this. Thin tab, thicker tab, you can see on the bottom, tells you the size, whoops, this is a standard. And so you want your standard cushion or whatever cushion you need, pop it back in, and everyone's happy. Um, all right, so my absolute favorite thing about this mask is the headgear. Headgear, I mean, overall, it's fairly standard. I think it's really weird that you have the ugly gray on the outside and then the cool blue on the inside, but uh, hey, that's, that's what it is. Um, what's cool about this is they have clips. I love clips because it just makes it easier to get on and off. Uh, but they, you don't have to clip anything. It is a magnet. How cool is that? So look, you just like get anywhere in the ballpark and it just kind of goes on where it needs to go. Boop. How sweet is that? I mean, that is like the coolest thing ever. And then what's really cool is you can tighten it. So I'm actually, I'm pulling pretty hard right now. Pulling hard, but you wanna get your mask off and it's just like, go forward with it and it comes right off. Pull hard, and then off. Seriously, that's like the coolest thing ever. I could do that all day, I love it. Um, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this on and talk at you more. Okay, so here we are, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. So you have both of the um, magnets, got it. Got both of the magnets off and you just kind of put it over your head and then watch this. You can like close your eyes and they just hook. How easy was that? Okay, so um, on the bottom straps, obviously that's gonna control how much pressure is here and then you can adjust these top and that's gonna pull it up. Uh, when I redid it, I can feel it's not as tight or snug as it needs to be. So I'm gonna tighten it here. Um, and then usually you wanna fit this when you're laying down. I'm gonna do it when I'm sitting up because it makes it easier for me. Um, I'll tell you right now, I'm gonna lay down with the pillow. This thing, it wasn't real comfortable when I was wearing it. Um, it has all these uh, kind of tough plastic edges and they kind of dug into my skin and uh, I don't know. I think that they have a lot better mask with the um, the ResMed uh, Swift FX Nano, and the Nano is all silicone and it just smushes, it's like so cool. Uh, this headgear is cool, but like, 
I wish they would have done a, a nano cushion instead, so it's just all silicone instead of this plastic stuff. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and add some air, and I'm gonna lay down with it and uh, move around for your viewing displeasure. But you can kind of hear. This is at 10 centimeters of water pressure. It's not as quiet as some of the other masks. So, so how does this do when you want to bury your face in the pillow? Right now I just got a giant leak up here. So this is kind of what was happening on the nights where I was trying it out. I kept getting these leaks up in the, all over the place. I don't know, I can just feel all this plastic stuff. I just, I don't know, I can't stand that anymore. There's too many other options. All right, so getting out of it, you just like, nah, pull it off. So overall, the ResMed um, AirFit N10 is, it's, it's an okay mask. I would, you know, if I'm gonna do this, I would either go with the Respironics um, Wisp or I would go with the ResMed a Swift FX Nano, not the Swift FX, because that's a nasal pillow mask. Very confusing. The Nano version, and that that one's cool. Um, this one's really nice, and the headgear is, like I said, man, this is so cool. Who doesn't love? It? Look at that! It just hooks on its own. Love it. So, um, other than that, it's just got some problems. Um, if you want to try it, because it's a new thing, hey, go for it. But um, overall, I think it um, is a little more uncomfortable, especially if you sleep on your side, because it does, it does have harder plastic stuff, which isn't a problem, but they have hard plastic stuff that gets in the way of your cheeks and like kind of digs in. Um, so that's my impression. Uh, maybe you have a different impression of it. And please visit my website, freecpapadvice.com, and you can join the forum if you have any questions, comments, whatever, uh, freecpapadvice.com forward slash forum. Hope to see you there. And thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.